very welcome back to all of you students i am your sst teacher vandana joshi and you are watching sst jo students in the previous video of the chapter growing up as boys and girls we have studied about few topics in which we have seen how the society is changing the minds of as a growing up boys and girls and how what are the barriers are decided by the society to boys and girls even students we also know that society also decided the colors as well for the boys and girls as the pink is considered for the girls and the blue is considered for the boys even then after that we have studied a story which was of hermit story uh, where we have seen that uh, they are not having any value of the householding works which has been done by their mother so students now let's see our today's topic of the chapter that is valuing house works so what we will see in this topic let's see so students as we have observed in the story of hermit the family of hermit did not think that the work which is done by jaspreet it is not a real work yani ki hermit ki mother jaspreet ke through jo kaam kiye jate hain unki koi bhi value nahi hai yani ki wo ek regular routine work hai jo ki har aurat ko karne chahiye they are thinking like that only okay and as it has been observed many time the householding work are not getting any value aapne bhi dekha hoga bachcho ki jo bahut sare log hote hain jo householding works hote hain unko koi value nahi di jati hai okay and Uh, even the value is not given to householding work by the family also okay but these are also important work uh, students as if your mother is not doing something to you in the house like she, if she will not prepare the food and the other householding work if she uh, not uh, complete them so uh, how you will complete these work so uh, as accordingly the householding works are also important if you will compare the householding work with the other works okay students also in many time it also assumed that women also not giving any importance to their work yani ki jo women hain wo khud hi apne work ko importance nahi deti hain therefore society devalues their work तो इसीलिए जो सोसाइटी है वो भी उनके काम को कोई वैल्यू नहीं देती है स्टूडेंट्स इफ यू विल सी इन द मेट्रो सिटीज एज यू हैव सीन इन हरमीत स्टोरी देयर इज़ नो वैल्यू ऑफ हाउस होल्डिंग वर्कस यहाँ पर कोई वैल्यू नहीं है बिकॉज दे आर डूइंग द वर्कस बाय देयर सेल्फ ओके बट इन द अदर हैंड इफ़ यू विल सी इन द अदर सीनारियो ऑफ द डोमेस्टिक वर्कर्स यानी कि वो वर्कर्स जो घर के काम करते हैं ओके दे ऑल आर कंसिडर एज अ एम्प्लॉय यानी कि जो डोमेस्टिक वर्क करने वाले लोग हैं वो एज अ एम्प्लॉय कंसिडर किए जाते हैं बिकॉज दे आर गेटिंग द मनी अगेंस्ट देयर वर्क यानी कि जो वो काम करते हैं उसके बदले में उनको क्या मिलता है पैसा मिलता है ओके एंड स्टूडेंट्स दे आर कंसिडर एज अ एम्प्लॉय इन द मेट्रो सिटी स्पेश यानी कि अगर आप बड़े शहरों में जाओगे जहाँ पे द बोथ पर्सन आर डूइंग द जॉब इन अ फैमिली सो दे आर हायरिंग द हाउस होल्डिंग वर्कर्स टू कंप्लीट देयर हाउस होल्डिंग वर्क ओके एंड स्टूडेंट्स टू नो मोर अबाउट हाउ द हाउस होल्डिंग वर्कर्स आर कंसिडर एज अ डोमेस्टिक वर्कर और एज अ डोमेस्टिक एम्प्लॉय लेट सी फ्यू सीन्स और फ्यू स्टोरीज विच provided in your civics book page number 49 student in your book a scenario has been given for the domestic workers it is the story of milani uh, she is a domestic worker and uh, uh, she is uh, uh, sharing her experience about as a domestic worker and uh, in this uh, she is sharing that uh, it was her first job uh, with a rich family and they were living in a three storied apartment Uh, melani was completing the kitchen works and there were two more girls uh, who were completing the householding works uh, she was saying that uh, her duty was started at 5 o'clock morning and uh, for the breakfast they were getting a cup of tea and two dry rotis uh, she uh, is also saying that uh, we could never get a third roti and even 
they were having a lots of problem while uh, the winter was there uh, they were not allowed to wear the chappals in the house uh, in the winter time it was so uh, cold and their feet were swelled up due to the cold okay and uh, she was saying that uh, she was getting uh, money but uh, she also felt uh, humiliated or angry because uh, she was not having any respect as a worker so students here as you have seen the story which has been shared by melani as a domestic worker it is uh, showing us a very deep meanings as a domestic worker so students uh, for stand that uh, those are the householding work for that the women's has to be stand a long time even more than 5 to 6 hour they are just standing and doing their householding works yani ki jo women hai unhe ghar ke jo kaam hote hain unhe karne ke liye kafi der tak khade rehna padta hai even when they are preparing food they have to stand in kitchen while washing clothes and cleaning work of हाउस दे हैव टू डू दीज वर्क बाई स्टैंडिंग ओके यानी कि आपने देखा होगा इवन इफ यू हैव सीन टू योर मदर स्टूडेंट्स शी इज डूइंग द हाउस होल्डिंग वर्क बाई स्टैंडिंग मैनी टाइम एंड इफ योर मदर इज अ वर्किंग वूमेन सो इट इज़ अ डबल वर्क टू हार दैट शी हैज़ टू बी कम्प्लीट द हाउस होल्डिंग वर्क एज वेल एज द द आउटसाइड एंड द जॉब वर्क ओके यानी कि अगर आपकी मदर जो है वो वर्किंग वूमेन है तो शी ऑल्सो हैज़ टू डू वर्क इन अ ट्वाइस वे उनको दोनों तरीके से काम करना है इवन इन होम एज वेल इन ऑफिस इवन स्टूडेंट्स समटाइम द हाउस होल्डिंग वर्क आर ऑल्सो सो मच टाइम कंज्यूमिंग हेयर आई एम शोइंग यू अ डाटा थ्रू विच यू विल बिकम टू नो वट इज द कंडीशन ऑफ द डोमेस्टिक वर्कर इन अवर कंट्री ओके एंड इफ यू विल सी इन दैट डाटा इट इज प्रोवाइडिंग अस अ फ्यू इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट द डोमेस्टिक वर्कर्स वट इज़ द प्रसेंटेज एंड वट आर द हाउस होल्डिंग वर्क विच आर बीन कम्प्लीट बाय द डोमेस्टिक वर्कर्स सो स्टूडेंट्स इफ वी टॉक अबाउट द हाउस होल्डिंग वर्क दे आर ऑल कंसिडर एज द हाउस कीपिंग वर्क विच शुड बी कम्प्लीटेड बाय स्पेशली द वुमेन ओके स्टूडेंट्स बट इट इज़ जस्ट ओनली हाउस होल्डिंग वर्क and it is only the responsibility of women that she has to be complete the all householding work no kyunki agar aapne dekha hoga mostly jo householding works hai beta wo aapki mummy ya fir aapne kisi bhi family mein dekha hoga women are only completing the householding work okay uh, so students already in the first video i told you the mind Uh, set up of the gender equality was already set up by our society yani ki jo gender equality hai iska mindset ek tarike se hamari society ke through hi set up kiya jata hai if uh, you have seen that all the householding works whether it is uh, women or girl it should be completed by them if the male persons are there in the family they are not supposed to complete these type of work because they are the male person okay in uh, means 95% family that is happening ye 95% families ki ek situation hoti hai jahan pe jo householding work chahe wo chote ho bade ho wo sare householding works uh, jo hai mahilaon aur ladkiyon ko hi karne padte hain and if the male persons are in the family they are just supposed to complete their outside work or whatever if the work is so much but uh, if the girl is not there the so the um, boys or the men are not supposed to complete that work that is only the responsibility of the women to complete this work because it already decided by society kyunki hamari society hai wo pehle se hi decide kar deti hai ki jo house holding work hai wo sirf mahilaon ko hi karne chahiye so students if we talk about the housekeeping works in the frame of equality अगर हम इक्वलिटी के अकॉर्डिंग बात करें हाउस होल्डिंग वर्क्स की सो द गवर्नमेंट इज़ प्रोवाइडिंग टू ईच एंड इंडिविजुअल पर्सन द राइट दैट एवरी वन इज़ ट्रीटेड एज इक्वल बट वाई द डिस्क्रिमिनेशन इज़ देयर इन अवर सोसाइटी सो स्टूडेंट्स एक्चुअली द डिस्क्रिमिनेशन इन अवर सोसाइटी बाय द जेंडर वाइज इट ऑलरेडी डिसाइडेड बाय द ह्यूमन बींग्स आपने देखा होगा कि गवर्नमेंट हमें हर तरीके के राइट्स प्रोवाइड करती है बट दैट 
दीज आर ह्यूमन ओनली दोज आर डिस्क्रिमिनेटिंग टू दैन सेल्फ ये हम ही लोग हैं जो एक दूसरे से भेदभाव करते हैं या फिर एक दूसरे से डिस्क्रिमिनेशन वाइज हम एक दूसरे को कंसिडर करते हैं ओके स्टूडेंट्स टू प्रोटेक्ट द राइट ऑफ ह्यूमन्स एंड एज वेल एज द वुमन ओके सारे जो लोग हैं उनके राइट एंड स्पेशली द वुमेंस दो आर डिस्क्रिमिनेटिंग जेंडर वाइज टू प्रोटेक्ट देयर राइट गवर्नमेंट हैज प्रोवाइडेड मैनी फैसिलिटीज टू वुमेन सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल गवर्नमेंट हैज़ प्रोवाइडेड द रिजर्वेशन इन मैनी गवर्नमेंट जॉब्स एंड इन द मैनी सोसाइटीज द वुमेंस आर गेटिंग द रिजर्वेशन टू गेट देयर पोजिशन इन दैट प्लेस Even to make the girls educated, uh, government has provided free education to the girls, and many schemes government has started uh, for the girls. Student, if you know that government has provided many facilities to improve the condition of women. government has provided the anganwadi centers through which the government can be improve the skills and the condition of the women uh, in the government aspects and second thing uh, the government has provided now the free education to the girl child uh, till they are 12th in government schools even the girls are getting many facilities which are provided by the government they are getting the reservation in many things like in jobs in uh, many policies which are provided by the government they are getting reservation in that and a uh, uh, few things are there which were started by the government like uh, the dowry system which was earlier in practice now it has been declared as illegal by the government government has given uh, right to equality in the property and as well the equal right to vote to each and every person in which we can include the women as well okay and student due to many efforts which has been done by our government now the women are empowered and now they are getting a good position in many areas students if you will see there are many names like bharat ratna mrs subalakshmi booker prize winner arundhati roy athlete pt usha social activist megha parker and many more women are showing that now women empowerment is going on in our country so students as you have seen in this chapter that uh, the chapter is talking about the gender discrimination it is also showing us that how the women are getting a good position now in our country as well as in over the world so students here the chapter is complete hope you understood this so for more videos and updates of your subjects keep watching sst june